what is up guys welcome back to the channel today I'm just gonna take you guys with me I'm going to be working on the G37 later on but first we're gonna do the oil change on the 240SX that's what I need to do right now eventually this car needs some work we're gonna get to it for sure I'm ordering the body kit all around and then we are going to focus on this we're gonna take off all the things, take them all out, and probably send it off to paint. That is the plan with this car. I mean, I know my attention right now is on the G37 Coupe, trying to fix it, so you guys can see how the G37 looks. Right now, we did the headlights, we did um, the hood, the, the trunk, did everything. And as you guys can see, we have all this mess. Uh, I have the OEM hood. I have the OEM trunk if anybody wants it um, feel free to send me a message on uh, Instagram and I'll be happy to answer any questions that you guys might have I have the side skirts as well OEMs um, this is a rear window visor but it's for another car I order it so I have to modify it in order to fit the G37 coupe I'll be working on that um, next week because the car is going to a show in San Francisco. So that is the plan. I need to work on the G37, get it ready. But first, I know this car needs oil change. I need to do a sap. As you guys can see, welcome back to my garage. There it is, where all the work happened on the G37. We are back, but my friend over there at his house, he has the canopies and everything. So I'm going to work over there on the 240SX. I just need to pick up um, uh, this so I can do my oil change. I need this for sure. And I need um, something to put the oil in. So I'm pretty sure that one it's going to be somewhere. <sighs> yeah, guys, sorry for the mess over here. All right, so. Again, there it is. We got OEM hood, trunk, side skirts. If anybody wants them, let me know. And there it is. That's what we need. I'm going to take this. And yeah, that's about it. That's all I need for the oil change on the 240SX. There it is, guys. Doing these clips without my glasses because you guys might think that I always use my glasses. But to be honest, it is really sunny here in California and I like to use my glasses, uh, they're my favorite ones. So it is what it is on the glasses. So right now it's time to head over there, um, work on the 240SX, and then we're gonna jump into the G37. And I will show you guys all the steps that we did on the wrap and everything that happened uh, in two weeks, cause it was fast. So uh, let's head over there, get the oil change done. I'm not going to show you guys how to do the oil change on the 240SX because you guys know already how to do it. So let's go. I just can't wait to get my, my body kit, guys. We're going to place the order in two weeks, I believe. The body kit, the side skirts, we got the carbon fiber hood. We got it there. We got the kooky headlights, but I want to get the projector ones. So there it is. My friend picked up uh, an IPL front bumper. He got it for super cheap. Check it out. I'm not gonna release any info on it. I'm not gonna tell you guys what's gonna be used for, but stay updated. He's gonna do something crazy with it. So just stay updated on that. It is OEM, not fiberglass. Nice, oh, I like it. It has everything for the fog lights. So we got here to my friend's house. Uh, I'm just waiting for the car to cool down just a little bit and that way we can start working on the oil change. That's the engine. It's been super reliable to me. I haven't had any issues. Um, 
for sure the plan is to go either sr20 or one jc but we will see uh still in the plan we don't know but we will get there eventually one day so i'm gonna raise up the car start removing everything for the oil change all right guys oil change is done on this car we are good to go so right now i'm just gonna head over to my house get the infinity i need to um Get new tires for that car we are taking it to san francisco for a show that we're gonna go to and my friend is gonna give me these two tires for the front so i'm just going to order two rear ones and yeah so let's take this car back and get the infinity okay guys so every time i have to do this i have to take off the cover of the car because uh basically i bought this so it can protect the paint but since I have wrapped now, so I mean, I want to protect my car from the rain, dust, and all that stuff. This thing is against the rain, so it's gonna protect the car real good. All right, so I'm gonna take the car over to a quiet place. I'm gonna take you guys with me. We'll go ahead and, and explain everything that we did to the car and what I have planned for it, cause I'm taking it to San Francisco. And yeah, so I'm gonna give you guys a cold start. I have my other camera right there. So, guys it is a beautiful view right here I picked this place because there's no cars coming we don't have any noise except for the birds but yeah guys so check it out so I told my friend to come along and do the video with me but he had other stuff to do he got busy so I guess I'll go over the stuff that um, I need to mention to you guys and what's gonna happen this uh, next week all right, so you guys know that I wrapped my car. It is red. So, and you guys know it is, um, I forgot what company my friend said, uh, but I'll keep you guys updated on that. If you guys wanna know about the wrap, what the company's name it is, and all that stuff. So we'll get over that later. So one thing that concerns me about, uh, my brother got a carbon fiber wrap from China. I don't even know from what part of China it is. But uh, we used it because I wanted to do my diffuser black. Didn't have any other wrap to work with except for red. So I went ahead and used that one. And there's little details. For some reason the wrap started to come out. It, like the glue didn't stick to the, the paint. So eventually I'm gonna take it off. Next week I order brand new wrap by 3M that's 3m the new wrap it's gonna be carbon fiber hey it is what it is it's wrapped so i mean there's gonna be people that are gonna hate on this whatever it is what it is if you don't like it if you don't like this channel just move on there's other channels out there that you guys might like so if you don't like mine it's okay just, you know i'm not gonna expect anybody to like my channel on the stuff that i do on my car so moving on i ordered wrap for the diffuser i want to get it ready before the show, I already ordered new tires because as you guys can tell, we don't have any tires and we have a four hour drive to San Francisco. Basically, it's gonna be San Francisco, somewhere Berkeley or something like that it is. Espocom, that's gonna be the show over there. So the car's ready, I'm gonna get new tires. My friend's gonna give me front new tires that uh, he doesn't need. So we are good on that. Uh, what else? <clears throat> you guys know I have the hood. You know, just take care. Um, take care of little details that I need to see. For example, when we remove this, now it's like coming out. So basically, we need to. And I don't know if I want to do my roof again. 
because I did it with uh, Vivid uh, products and I didn't like it. I mean, I like the glossiness that the wrap has, but I just didn't like the way that um, it shrinks and it starts to come out. So that's that. Uh, car, it's gonna be in Espocom, San Francisco. I'm gonna take it. I didn't wanna take it, but you know, it's all right. I mean, I'm gonna show you guys what I, what we did to the car. And it is what it is. I paid this company, so-called Retrofit, to do my headlights and I know I can't release any pricing on them please don't ask me just go straight to them that was part of my deal not to release the price so if you guys want to want the same headlights please go and contact the guy and be like hey I want the same setup or something I mean so far I haven't had any issues with the headlights I've, I've had a couple people coming at me saying like oh they're gonna go bad within two three days I mean it is what it is I mean you guys gotta remember it is custom work I mean it's not gonna be you know it's like if I do fiberglass IPL it's not gonna fit the same because it is aftermarket come on guys I mean you guys need to understand that uh, if I order this trunk it is aftermarket you guys don't see it but there's like little details that I mean fitment issues you're gonna get them in any way so I mean just keep that in mind guys if you order aftermarket parts I mean they're not gonna be like OEM parts so that's what I want to tell you guys about the headlights whatever company you are I'm not gonna mention you just go straight to them and be like I don't like what you do and you know uh, I want to get all the business or I don't know whatever but that's their problem not my problem I don't have issues and hopefully I don't get issues, but they're under warranty. So I'm not worried about it. It is what it is. Yeah, so that's that's that fam. I did the oil change on the S14. Uh, I just wanted to talk about the wrap, everything that we did. We did the trunk, the hood, the wrap, and we're gonna do the diffuser this week. We're gonna head over to San Francisco and hope I can meet some of you guys. Drop in the comments who is going to Espocom in San Francisco and hope i can see you guys there and uh, show support again keep showing support to the chat so right now i'm just going to do um, a couple rolling clips i'm gonna put my other camera and i'm just gonna pass the camera and then let's see how the car looks Alright guys, this is gonna be, that's it for the video, I hope I can bring you guys more vlogs and I hope you guys like them, give them thumbs up and for sure I'll, I'll see you guys for the next one and if you go to San Francisco, Espocom, let me know down in the comments and hopefully we can do a photo shoot or something, but yeah guys, other than that, uh, I'll see you guys till the next one, don't forget to comment, like and subscribe and I'll see you guys soon, peace. <laughs>